Welcome to Central. This video is meant to be a quick start guide for connecting to your new Central server from your Leapfrog modeling product. With continuous modeling, you can make ongoing incremental improvements in your models as data becomes available instead of every year or so. An exploration project might need to revise models every week, an operations project could be updated every day, or even several times a day. That means you need to manage all the revisions and store the project data in sensible and safe ways. Central helps you really apply the scientific method, integrate new knowledge, plan tests to validate or eliminate hypotheses, and review models with peers. You can easily differentiate between reviewed and approved models from ones that explore experimental hypotheses. For this demonstration, I'm going to start out in Leapfrog Geo. However, the processes that I'm going to show are the same in the other Leapfrog modeling products as well. To activate your connection to Central, we must first enable Central Integration. Click on the Leapfrog menu, scroll down and select Settings. Find Central in the Contents list on the left. We will then click in the checkbox to enable Central Integration. Below, we can choose the location for local copies of downloaded Central projects, the publishing cache location, in case the default C drive location is full or restricted, as well as setting server timeouts below. You may want to adjust these timeouts depending on the reliability of your internet connection. Then, in the connection section, check the box to use Sequent ID. This window will appear asking you to confirm that you want to continue as Leapfrog will need to restart. Click Continue. Leapfrog will close. When you reopen Leapfrog, confirm that you are signed in over here in the top right. If you are not signed in, click and select Sign In. You will be prompted to enter your Sequent ID. After signing in, the central servers you have access to via your Sequent ID will be listed in your new Central Projects tab. Thanks for watching and join us for the next video showing how to open a central project.